Supersonic. Side boosters are now throttling back up to full Vehicle power. Has reached maximum dynamic pressure. We're past max Q, the period of maximum loads on the vehicle. Next up, we'll be waiting for the side boosters to begin to throttle down prior to booster engine cutoff and separation two and a half minutes into flight. GNC trajectory looks good on the Falcon Heavy. Reports show that the M1D engine performance is nominal. Contact engine sales begun. Side boosters have begun to throttle down in preparation for the upcoming shutdown in 20 seconds. Major event coming up Second with side booster down. shutdown and separation. And so shut down. Side boosters. Deeper. Center. Successful separation. We're coming up on Nico and shutdown. Stay set. Good recognition. This big bang looks good inside boosters. Start up. Coming core, up on start bearing up. separation. Center core side engines on fire, also look good. Wow, wow, <laughs> did you guys see that? That, 
was awesome. That's the only thing I can <laughs> really uh, say Absolutely right wild. Absolutely wild. <laughs> I, I got nothing else. Oh, man. Uh, recapping all the great things that you just saw there. Uh, successful liftoff from the pad, successful stage separation. But before that, successful booster separation, you can see stage one. Uh, the two side boosters, pardon me, you can see the center core and you can see MVAC lit up. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> then the beautiful shots of uh, Starman chilling in the Tesla Roadster. Uh, <laughs> absolutely incredible. Um, <laughs> on, on your screen at the moment, uh, you've got a few things happening. On the upper right, you've got MVAC D continuing its burn. Uh, on the upper left, you have the center core headed back towards the autonomous spaceport drone ship. And in the two bottom screens, you've got the side boosters headed back towards Cape Canaveral Air Force Station landing zones one and two. Uh, the next step coming up for the side boosters and the center booster uh, is the re-entry burn. Uh, that's going to slow it down from uh, or slow all the boosters down from way faster than the speed of sound to just faster than the speed of sound uh, in order to reduce some of those aerodynamic forces and heating that occurs when you're moving that quickly through the atmosphere. And as you can see on your screen, that reentry burn for those two cycles from the FBI. That's all boosters entry burn shut down. Side core entry burn so. The center core in the upper left of your screen performing its own reentry burn. You can see the, the edge of Cape Canaveral in uh, both of the side booster cameras as those are coming in. And PY and NY side boosters have saved. Center core entry burn shut down. Uh, and even though those look very similar, those two boosters' uh, views, those are actually representing different boosters. Um, and they're heading towards Earth. They're about to begin their landing burns. We'll hopefully be able to bring you nice footage of that. Both side boosters transonic. And watch for the landing lights to play at the tail end of that landing. And that landing burn has started. Both boosters looking to be on track towards their respective landing zones. Both landing lights have started. Side boosters landing legs have deployed. And the Falcons have landed. LZ1, LZ2, both side boosters have touched down. Landing legs have landed. 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 And coming up very shortly, the Center Corps will be attempting its landing on the autonomous spaceport drone ship. Check on your screen. Sometimes this footage goes out when it approaches the drone ship and the heavy vibrations make it lose signal. We're crossing our fingers, that's not the case right now. 